Today in Tracy's basement, we've got an awesome figure to show you guys from Big Bad Toy Store. Welcome back to the basement, welcome to the channel. If you've never been here before, today we have a package from Big Bad Toy Store. Jason has been anxiously awaiting this yes. particular package. And Da Shredder is very appropriate for this package. <laughs> I've been waiting for this to come in. Uh, you guys all know how much I've stated lately that I love the, the Bandai Tamashi Nations, like figure arts, figures and stuff like that. And this just landed from Big Bad Toy Store, which... I can't gush enough over that company, mind you. Um, they have so much stuff to pick up on their site. It's awesome. Amazing variety of toys and collectibles. Yeah. Tons of genres, tons of fandoms. But my favorite thing about them is they have a feature called Box of Loot. And this is like really uh, cool for you guys like in Canada and like overseas and stuff like that too. Because y'all know how much when you know, you're ordering from a company like from the States you really got to order enough to make the shipping count. Definitely. Right? Because I mean, sometimes I've ordered like a, you know, if you try to order a single pop from one of those sites, you know, you're paying three times the shipping just to get like the pop to you or something like that. Uh, and Big Bad Toy Store has this pile of loot feature where you just pay for the item and they put it aside with the rest of your items. And when you build up enough items that you feel the shipping is worth it, then they send it all out at once. Exactly. It's and absolutely perfect. I love it. I've Great been, feature. I've been using them for a long time now. It's where I get most of my um, Dragon Ball figures, yeah. actually. I get a lot of... Uh, a lot of, variety of Dragon Balls. Yeah, I get a lot of Dragon Ball figures there. So, just yeah, that's just a quick plug for them. I'll throw their link down in the description box below because I do love their site. Definitely check them out. And this is what I've been waiting for. And it is Raphael from the old Ninja Turtles cartoon, <laughs> done in the figure art style. These are so cool. They are so well done to really look like the turtles from that 80s cartoon show, which we grew up with, of yep. course. And of course, classic uh, figure art style. It comes with all kinds of additional parts. It's got super hyper poseability. But, let's get them open to show you guys. <laughs> we recently showed you guys the Monster Arts alien figure in one of our previous videos. This is the Figure Arts version. Same basic line. They come with so many extra little pieces, extra hands, extra faces, uh, different, you know, props and all that kind of thing. And they are so, so, so articulate. Right. They have the extra tons of articulation points. And there's the Raphael there. And like, look at that. That's awesome. How awesome does he look? He looks exactly like the cartoon oh, this version. Is, this is a great little figure. And he's, he's got a good bit of heft to him, too. Actually, oh, yeah. I feel that. Like, he's, oh, yeah. yeah, he's not bad. He's, he's, he's not uh, hefty. He's not light. He's, he's nice and, and thick and sturdy. And again, like I say, so many articulation points. Everything moves. The shoulders, the elbows, the wrists, the knees, hip joints, toes, neck hips like you can put these guys in so many different poses because basically everything moves and again they come with all the little props different hands so that they can hold the different props to come with them some of them come with different faces just so many awesome yeah. parts they do an amazing job yeah, on these amazing figures. figures so he comes with six additional hands on top of the two that he already has and you can pop the back of his belt off and place it with the little side holder pieces, if you want. Extra. If you want, to, you know, if you want to put his size in the back, I'll probably pose him with the size in his hands. Though. Definitely. <laughs> so the default hands that he comes with are basically fists, but Jason has swapped them out for the gripping hands so that he can hold his size because, of course, that's oh, just yeah. classic. Come on, I'm having him with his size. <laughs> he also comes with a little kunai and a little shuriken if you want him to yeah. be holding different weapons and an extra head with him with it you know more of an open facial expression that's one of my favorite things about a lot of the figure arts is that they come with the different yeah, faces so they come you with... can have them really looking the way you want yeah i really 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 like them so as you can see from jason playing with it you can <laughs> manipulate them to get them into whatever kind of pose you like 
very nice. The, the feet on them are very articulative as well so that you can yep. get them so that they're not falling over, you know, yep. when you get them to a nice You stance. can adjust the, the feet at many angles. You can even adjust the toes at many angles to kind of help with the, uh, you know, standability, I guess is the word. I don't know what the word is, but uh, yeah, I, 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 I can't gush enough over these lines of figures. They're, they're absolutely awesome. And when I seen they had Raphael, because Raphael was my turtle. So I, I, you know, I, I love Raphael. He, he's just, he's just so mad, and <laughs> angry. Uh, you know, not so much in the old cartoon. He's more just, you know, the wisecracker, sarcastic. Yeah, sarcastic guy. Uh, but like in all the movies and everything, Raphael. I don't know. Raphael's just the best. I don't care. <laughs> Raphael's the best. You can yell at me in the comments. I don't care. Raphael's the best. <laughs> These figures are just so much fun because you can get them just how you want them and in addition to all the posability, all the articulation points, they're just extremely well done, well molded, well painted, beautiful looking figures yeah. that make an excellent addition to any yeah. display. So once again, uh, go check out Big Bad Toy Store, uh, especially if you're international too because of that pile of loot feature because like I said, I can't, uh, I can't recommend that enough. Uh, I've been using them for a few years now and, and it just always pays off for me in the shipping Definitely. department. It, it's, it's just saved, so saved great. It saves us a lot of money on shipping. Damn, this guy's awesome. So that is the SH Figure Arts Raphael from the 1980s cartoon show. Let us know what you guys thought about him in the comments section below and let us know what your favorite Ninja Turtle is. If you've enjoyed the video, please give us a big thumbs up, share with your friends, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. You can also follow us on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and Snapchat at Tracy's Basement, Jason from TV on Twitter. And of course, as always, keep coming back for more Tracy's Basement. Bye. He's so awesome. You look awesome on the shelf. <laughs>